For some time now, we've been aware of this issue in developing countries where there are a multitude of healthcare facilities that lack access to electricity. And uh, one of the major outcomes of this is uh, there's an inability to sterilize instruments. And this causes a range of problems. It, it results in healthcare acquired infections and, and other issues. So um, my buddy, me, myself, and a few of my buddies here who are engineers got together and we said, hey, well, why don't, why don't we do something about this? And so we put our brains together and came up with this um, a, a way of circumventing the need for electricity and giving an autoclave uh, uh, a method to be powered by the sun. And so uh, for those of us that don't know, autoclave is just used to sterilize instruments. It's typical in every hospital setting. It benefits us in a number of ways. Uh, one, there's a lot of skills and experience that's gained just through the process of, of putting together these presentations, putting together the technology, and having to work together and overcome a lot of the challenges. Um, being engineers and a public health student, one thing that um, we have had to grow in is, is kind of this business savviness, you know, and we've had some help along the way. We've talked to uh, different mentors like Dr. Marshall and some others, and they've been really helpful to us. So it's, it's great for us in that regard. It's also great just learning to collaborate. Um, I think it definitely gives exposure to us as well, and so creates opportunities for us in the future. And, and one reason I really appreciate these events is it will help attract investors and get people on board and excited about our idea and hopefully carry it forward in the future to actually to, to, to produce it and, and distribute it and actually help a lot of people.